This is the Liverpool side. John Matic starts with Virgil van Dijk at the back. Jordan Shakiri starts with Sadio Mane out wide. Daniel Sturridge is the main striker today. Here's the Chelsea lineup. It's a real group mentality in this lineup about pressing the opposition into making mistakes and cashing in on it straight away. Well, it takes a lot of energy, a lot of motivation. It's easy to drop off, and when you do drop off that really aggressive closing down, that's when it can fall down. Yeah, it was men against boys, wasn't it, in that reverse fixture? I really can't see it being the same here, you know. He's got his shot off now. Goalkeeper. Oh, can you believe it? It is a penalty. Step up, the penalty taken now to put his side in front. Clumsy challenge. Yeah, it was a clumsy challenge, and the lad stepping up is normally reliable from 12 yards. Over the top. He's missed the penalty. I think that's what you would call a, a lack of composure there. Lost his nerve. James Milner. Sherdan Shakiri. An incisive pass. Brilliant pass. Can he finish it? Mane! It's Mane, the main man again with the goal. He has become such an accomplished finisher. He followed his instincts, he followed the play in, and then he followed watching the ball into the net. Yeah, lesson for any schoolboy, just to make sure you follow shots in, that you're in that danger area. And the supporters, well, they've upped their game, there's no question about that, just listen to them. Yeah, they've been brilliant, but it's been a close game. This should wrap it up. Well, he's actually hit the frame of the goal, but how he hasn't scored from there with such power. Just didn't seem to be concentrating enough, maybe took his eye off the ball. Well, in a way, Alan, the game has been irrelevant because already they knew they'd clinched the title. Everyone in the ground, including the players, waiting for the presentation to reward this outstanding season from an outstanding team. Yeah, it's been a party atmosphere. Hasn't it really from start to finish? I've experienced it myself in '91 when we played Manchester United, but uh, it doesn't taste any less sweet for those lads down there. And they've enjoyed the game, but really, most of all, they've enjoyed the season. They have been superb, undoubtedly the outstanding team. Well, I think so. Sometimes when their rivals faltered, they kept their eyes fixed firmly on the target and they really did stick together they had injuries one or two suspensions but they kept picking up the results and now they are about to pick up what it's all about they are the champions Oh, wonderful scenes. Scenes and moments they will never forget. You look back in 20 years' time and you'll think about this day. To share it with the supporters. They've had a great bond. Great travelling fans as well as the, uh, the home followers. They certainly haven't been without the backing that every team needs to... Go week in, week out in this most demanding of leagues. Great occasion here. Had time to set it all up, knowing that this presentation day would take place. It didn't depend on the result of the match.